Viewer discretion is advised. Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome back to LSPDFR. Today we're back out here in Blaine County in the Grand Sonora Desert with this beautiful 2016 FPIU made by JJ Dawkins. I gotta say, this thing looks phenomenal. Love the AOPR system we got going on up there. Got a Valor Light Bar, which I'm not really a fan of, but I mean, in game it looks better than it does in real life, is just my opinion on it. But we got this awesome blue skin made by Skins by Thomas, and I gotta say, it's like a pretty, like, somewhat of a basic skin, but I just love the blue on it, like the blue and the kind of, like, grayish, whitish it's got going on, and then just the gold. Just looks good. Like, I just like it. The only thing, though, it does not have a license plate. Which, I mean, ain't the worst thing in the world. But, I mean, it's a pretty decked out uh, 2016 FPIU, though. Let's go ahead and check out the interior really quick. Fully detailed. Got a spotlight. Uh, hands somewhat line up with the wheel. Uh, dials don't work. Got a LiDAR. Watch guard. Laptop. Cage. All that fun stuff. Little dome light up there as well. Here's a look at the lights. The one thing I do not like about this FPIU though is that it, ELS is backwards. So this is your stage one. This is be your stage two. And then your stage three is just the lights in the back there. But here's a look at the front. I forgot to show that off. Check that out. I love the wig wagon uh, lights they got down here in the bumper. I like those. I like that a lot actually. But yeah, here's your stage one, just the back lights, which. I think we'll be using that on like traffic stops and whatnot, not traffic stops, but like if we're out here and whatnot. So, uh, but yeah, that is basically the 16 Explorer. Um, if you guys did see my post in my Discord and on YouTube last night, I actually went in and found a backup of my 0.4 folder before I went ahead and put those add-ons in for um, the videos throughout the weekend, the McDonald's one, and then the uh, the delivering the chargers and whatnot. So I went ahead. And made a backup and I forgot I had made that backup and I found it so I'm like thank the lord but the only thing though is I'm currently starting to update everything in LSPDFR so at the moment we have 8.0 which this week I will definitely be making a video of 8.0 I'm showing off the brand new uniforms and stuff like that so um, I don't have the custom duty belt in I do not have the beards in just because EUP you did update so uh like I said, stay tuned for that video, as well as that new America Truck Simulator trailer is in GTA 5. I'll have a video on that sometime upcoming this week as well. So stay tuned for those. But for this episode today, we are going to actually have a one-call episode. Just because I don't want to push it too much with this game and the way it is. I want to go ahead and update it. Try to update it throughout the week and whatnot. So... We're going to go with that. I might do one or two more things with 0.4. And then we're going to go back to 0.3 for a little bit. But we're not going to do like normal patrolling like we're doing today in 0.3. Um, let me actually go tell dispatch we're good to go before I finish my story. 241 County. B1041 10A. It looks like I don't have the police radio on so I'm not on duty. What? Okay. Well, I guess we'll go on duty here later. Um, let me finish up my story. But, um, yeah, so we're going to go back to 0 0.3 for a little bit. Um, I'm not going to go ahead and do, like, regular style of patrolling and whatnot. I'm actually going to go ahead and do a couple different callouts um, and different mods for LSPDFR that are actually only available for 0 0.3. So that's what we're going to be rolling with. Maybe next week, the week after, stuff like that. I kind of want to spread it out a little bit so it's not all, like, at once. I kind of want to do a mix of 0 0.3, 0 0.4, 0 0.3, 0 0.4, etc., 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 so, that will be that. Um, but yeah. So, next week, expect 0 0.3, 0 0.4 the week after. Same thing, and then probably same thing going forward for like the next couple months or so. And then there goes my damn controller. Brand new Xbox controller, yet it just doesn't want to sync up to my uh, wireless adapter half the time. And I kind of don't understand why, but now it's back online. <laughs> but yeah, guys. So yeah, stay tuned for 0 0.3 coming up soon. Um, hope you guys do enjoy the video. Let's go ahead and get right into this one call episode. Make sure you hit that like button if you haven't already. 241's 10-4, I'm 76. So we got a uh, pursuit of a military tank just up behind us here. So we're going to go ahead and respond to that. For Shirley and Sandy Shores, this is going to be something that's 
probably unheard of. They should find this probably more so by uh, Fort Zancudo and stuff. But never thought you'd have a pursuit of a military tank out here in Sandy Shores. 241, I've located that tank. I'll be out. Uh, show me in pursuit. It has stopped here on Marina and Mountain View. Looks like suspect's going to be fleeing on foot. Suspect's going to be fleeing southbound on foot. It's going to be a female. I want to take my vehicle just because I don't want to chase her on foot this entire time. 241, we're heading eastbound through backyards right now. We just fucked her up. Good God. And I didn't do my weapons. Of course not. Of course not. There we go. Simple as that. 241, we're on foot right now. We're going to be Algonquin and Chola Springs. We're going to be running through backyards across the road. 241, Taser has been deployed. Get on the ground, lady. Get on the ground. I'm going to tase you again if you don't get on the ground. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. There we go. Wait for back. Okay, we got one more shotgun. We're good. We're good on backup. We're definitely good on backup. I want to try this thing real quick. No 241. Uh, eh. 241. I got one in custody right now. <laughs> I don't know. It just didn't look weird. It looks weird without a radio being there. Come over here with me. Come over here on the side with me. At this point in time, you have the right to remain silent. I think you can so be held against you in the court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford one, one will be appointed to you. Do you understand your rights? You understand them? Perfect. So with these rights in mind, do you wish to go ahead and answer any questions I'm about to ask you? Go for it, pig. Oh, okay. What you doing out here today? Why are you out here driving a uh, military tank out here in the streets of Sandy Shores? Don't need to answer that. I mean, yeah, you're right. You don't need to answer that. But, I mean, it's probably better to be completely honest with me right now and make it so much easier for you in court. And not to mention the fact that you have a stolen military vehicle out here as well. So, I mean, that kind of doesn't help your case out a little bit. Uh, where are you coming from today? Like, you come, where are you coming from? Coming from your friend's home? Your friend involved in the military tank pursuit as well? Is she Was she in the tank or is she just you? Okay. Where were you headed to in that tank? So you went from a friend's house, went ahead and stole a tank, and then you're going to go to another friend's house with said tank. Is that, that's kind of what I'm getting on you. Have you been doing any drugs or anything recently? You use from time to time? Okay, okay. How about any drinking today at all? No? Alright, do you have anything illegal on you whatsoever? Any guns, knives, pocket knives, use needles, anything like that at all? You're a good citizen? I want to second guess that. I wonder if I can, like, request a, uh, female deputy. I thought I could, but I guess I can't, unless that's an on-scene backup. So we'll go ahead and pat her down. Alright, ma'am, if you, if you don't mind, I'm going to go ahead and pat you down really quick just to make sure you don't got anything that's going to poke me, stick me, harm me, or anything like that, okay? Alright, go ahead and turn around for me. Oh, there goes my damn controller again. You no, know, I, I seriously might go back to the one I had before, because I don't understand it. <laughs> It's a brand new controller too. So we got a wire cutter, a rusty spoon, a pocket knife, and matches. Alright, it's nothing really um nothing too nothing too big, so. So, yeah. Oh, I got that damn controller working back again. Sorry about that. Allison Jackson. Oh boy, I was thinking Alan Jackson. Good old Chattahoochee. 241 County. 2729 Allison Jackson 3761 common spelling okay you got a warrant out for her arrest awesome hey uh, Miss Jackson I'm sorry Miss Jackson ooh I am for real you understand you have a warrant out for your arrest you do alright you know what the warrant's for armed robbery I kind of figured you're out here stealing stuff <laughs> alright Miss Jackson come over here with me yeah, Miss Jackson, I'm for real. I never meant to make your daughter cry, but I don't apologize. Ha <laughs> ha. Well, I'm gonna walk you back to my vehicle, okay? So at this point in time, we placed you under arrest for possession of a stolen vehicle, possession of stolen government property, 
Um, you're also going to be charged for resisting arrest as well as um, that warrant that you have out for you, okay? You understand what you're being charged for today? All right, awesome, awesome, awesome. Go and hop in the back for me. I'm going to open the door for you. It's nice and dry in there. Go ahead and hop in. There you go. Okay, I guess I like semi-closed the door. There we go. Alright, let's go ahead and around back. Let's go ahead and hop on here. Let's go to the computer. Hopefully it doesn't crash. I updated it, so I'm hoping it doesn't crash. Even though I know it probably will. Ooh, manslaughter while under the influence. Ay ay ay. Um, she was arrested for burglary. So, I mean, technically she was kind of truthful. But, um, it did say she was under the influence of stuff, so I'm not going to deal with that right now. We're going to go and take her down to the station and kind of deal with that, just because I'm not really a drug officer at the moment. I'm just kind of like a deputy just out of FTO training. So, what we're going to do... Is I'm gonna go ahead and issue her an arrest report. Now don't mind this, um it's not a uh, senator or whatever uh, aligned correctly. But it's gonna be traffic. She's definitely gonna be under the influence, but we're not gonna charge her with that just yet. Um she's gonna be charged with evading arrest, because she kinda did. Uh wasn't anything like um violent. It was non violent, she had that warrant. She was resisting, definitely. Uh, ch -ch -ch. none of these, none of these. She wasn't in possession of any drugs. It's kind of like burglary tools because she did have the wire cutters and stuff like that. So burglary tools. Um, not in possession of a firearm. Possession of stolen property. Stolen vehicle. No government property here, unfortunately. And then wasn't anything like that. No, she didn't destroy it that I know of. And none of those. Save and close. So here we go. We got six charges on her for this one. She was arrested for one. Now she's got six. So. Alright, I'm going to go back over here. See if the tank is actually still on the roadway. Just because we're going to try to tow it for evidence even though we can't really tow a tank. But we'll see what we can do with it. Um, let's just see if it's still. Now it looks like it did despawn or Blaine County did something with it. So I'm not going to worry too much about it. Uh, 241 County. Show me out 107 of the Sandy Shore Station with one. I'm just up the road. You're going to jail for a long time, lady. Long, long, long time. Or, you know, she could be small and just get, um, just get 16 felony charges dropped on her. Who knows? Who knows? Who freaking knows? Got a right blinker on, but we're turning left. Hashtag rebel. But yeah, who knows? She's got six charges on her. Who knows? It could all be dropped within tomorrow. No trial. But, that's none of my business. Leave the drop off. Oh, there's a the drop off. I actually haven't tried the new drop-offs yet, so let's see how this works. Have no evidence to store. So we'll escort the suspect by ourselves and see if this actually works, because I know back with the rest manager or whatever plugin did it, um, it used to crash. So, but here we are at the Los Santos can here we are at the Los Santos jail, as always. Never the Blaine County jails, Los Santos. Let's see if I could um putting her in here and be like yo I got one for you nope alrighty get in here lady wow. alright so at this point in time are you under the influence of anything okay I'm going to go ahead and issue you a breathalyzer and a drugalyzer test to make sure you're not under the influence of anything okay so this first one's going to be a breathalyzer what you're going to do is you're going to blow in this tube for me until you hear a beep alright take a deep breath and just keep blowing Appreciate it. 
Okay, so she wasn't lying about that. And this next one's going to be a drug swab test. What I'm going to do is I'm going to swab the inside of your cheek with a Q-tip. This will let me know if you've done any drugs in the past like 40, 48 hours or so. Marijuana and meth. Alright, so at this point in time you'll also be placed under arrest for driving under the influence of methamphetamines and marijuana, okay? So on top of the warrant for your arrest, uh, possession, of possession of stolen property, possession of a stolen vehicle, possession of burglary tools, the warrant you had out for your arrest, resisting arrest and evading, you'll also be charged with DUI, okay? Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and do is release these cuffs off of you. Actually, I'll keep you in cuffs. They can get the cuffs. And, uh, hope you have a great day. I don't know if that's something to say to someone you've arrested, but oh well. <laughs> Got a traffic stop backup required. We're not going to deal with that because we're not a city unit. But yeah, like I said, I'm kind of going to do a video of these EUP uniforms here. This week or so, as well as the one with the new ATS trailer. So stay tuned for those videos. But that is going to go ahead and do it, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. Smash that like button if you did. Drop a comment down below letting me know what you think. And let me know if you guys want to see any other departments, any different departments, real life departments, fictional departments, etc, etc, etc. Let me know in the comments below. As well as if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button if you are enjoying. My name is Yo Adrian. Hope you guys have a great rest or a great start to your week. Great rest of your weekend. Um, hope you guys do join my Discord server. It's always popping in there. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram. Always post cool stuff on there as well as Snapchat. Everything is down in the description below, as well as this car and the textures for it. But uh, yeah, guys, that's going to go ahead and do it. Take care.